Hello everyone, I'm just coming on to share with you some happy mail that has come through the door. Uh, it's actually an entry into my giveaway. And um, when I saw this in the corner, this little male uh, with this lovely face, I had a suspicion who this was from. Um, anyway, I've opened it. So as you can see, I've taken off this lovely washi tape that she's put on to seal the envelope. Can't show you the front obviously because that has my name and address on so this is from the lovely little sue who um and uh, i had actually forgotten sue that you said that you were going to enter so that is, is lovely <laughs> oh, sorry excuse me the thing's falling down so this is the um card that she sent just for you look at this how beautifully it is layered up it's just gorgeous all these different layers with this, um, this is a kind of like a vellum that's been cut out with the Just For You. And inside, she's put this little pocket and enclosed the um, ATC card. And it just says to Christine, congratulations on 400 subbies. Hope you like all the die cuts and ATC. Thanks, Q, for an amazing giveaway challenge. Love, Sue. And again, some more beautiful um, borders around there. So absolutely stunning card. And this is her lovely ATC. So here we have one of the gorgeous girls. Um, uh, the background paper looks like a painty paper with which has been stamped. And then this lovely image on the top. And then she's just put a flower here and some gems around. Beautiful, isn't it? And um, she says she likes blue, purple, pink, shabby chic and vintage. Any crafts, loves trying new crafts. So do I. That is <laughs> one of the dangers of YouTube is you see new things happening and you think, oh, I want to try that. And then so, you know, supplies sort of start bulging, don't they? But anyway, so that's the, the ATC. That's the lovely card and the ATC there. And, um, and then she sent this huge bag of die cuts. And, um, I, you know, I did mean it when I said just a couple. But anyway, I'm very grateful. And particularly, as I can see, there are lots and lots and lots of flowers in here. So I haven't seen the die cuts. So let's have a look at them together. So here we have... I wonder if that... Oh yeah, so there's the background and then the die cut for a thank you and another one. Um, oh, there we are. There's the thank you for that. So I put a white one on, on the silver thank you on the white and a white one on the silver background. I expect that's how it's meant to be. So that's very nice. And then she sent me some butterflies, which are always useful never have enough butterflies can we so here is another one with the base and the the top which is gorgeous and then these two I, I this is really what well, this one is really pretty I don't know can you see that really really pretty and then this one um let's see if there are any more butterflies or anything before we attack the flowers so then we have flowers, flowers, look at these gorgeous flowers. And this one, this one really took my eye. Look how beautiful that is. I have never seen a die cut like that before. Unless, Sue, you made that yourself, laboriously um, gluing each one of those petals, which you may have done. So that this one, and then there's one here which has been made up into a flower. And then... Um, there are quite a few. Uh, let's have a look. Sorry for this um, sorting out. I think it's just easier if a way, an easier way to do it. Well, there's another one that's been made up with. Oh, it's didn't realise she's made it up with book paper and then coloured it. It's very nice. And then, um, and then there are these ones. So there's two gold and two silver like that. Gorgeous. And there are some smaller ones also in silver and the gold. Beautiful. So we're going to have fun with these, making them up. 
and then there's the teeny toty ones as well two of those and then there are two silver and two silver so that's those there's um there's two like this so i guess oops i guess they they go together a bit like that to make a flower and another one that's already made up and then we've got the gold and this and the orange in different sizes the yellows the orange oops another gold two more golds so they're lovely and then I've got a stalk. You see the stalk. And these leaves, these petals, sorry. Um, which I guess I can put together to make a flower. These four. Five. And then some leaves. Actually, there are six there are six of those. And then these these tiny little things, which are really sweet as well. So, so thank you so much for all of these. Um, they're absolutely wonderful and they will be very useful because, um, as you know, um, I'm going to try and use the majority of the die cuts that I've received. I'm going to try and make projects with them and share them with you on YouTube. So um, watch this space for these. And uh, I know there are a few more entries to come. I've been in contact with a few lovely ladies. Um, if you put your name down, or even if you didn't put your name down, and you still want to enter but haven't managed to yet, um, do please let me know because I am prepared to extend the the um, closing date from the 18th of August if there are still some outstanding entries to come in. You know, I do appreciate you know that I put up this challenge during the summer holidays. And probably everybody's really busy with children and going away and all the rest of it. So uh, I quite understand if you know things have got behind. But it, as I said, if you do, if you haven't been in touch with me recently, like yesterday, um, and do want to enter still, please just um, drop me an email. I will leave my email address in the description box below, and um, you can. Um, just send me an email saying what the situation is so there we are so those are all the lovely entries so thank you again sue for this it was a lovely surprise and um yeah take care and uh, i'll be seeing you all shortly and i just apologize for my war wounds here um i will just share this with you i i'm um, the lovely Roz was um, selling her Gemini and I uh, I bought it from her and it arrived today and I was like, so excited, you know, getting things out of the, of the box that I cut my hand on the metal plates. <laughs> so, <laughs> so there we are. Um, but anyway, it's all right. It, you know, I, I can survive and uh, I'm really looking forward to having this uh, electronic die cutting machine instead of having to crank the handle all the time because i had um an x cut one if you're not familiar with the x cut it folds up and it is extremely heavy and very big and i had nowhere to put it you know so i i didn't really use my dies so now i'm hoping that with this i'll be able to to use my dies i will just share with you what what she sent me as um she added some extras into the box I haven't actually I haven't actually taken the the I haven't actually set it up yet but um, I will just share with you because amazing and I'm, I'm really grateful Ros but you're very naughty so this is a lovely card that she sent me I'm just going to lift this up a bit because um, yeah this is the card that she sent me so beautiful so it's um there's this back, black backing 
um, paper at the back and then this lovely um, this is raised polka dots and it's got little lovely little dots uh, there which you can hardly see which are like pearlescent then this silver frame and then on top of this this paper topper and then these suitcases and bags Isn't that lovely and she just says um, uh, I've been, no, no, she just says at the end, um, enjoy the extra goodies too. Much love, Roz. So this is what she sent me in the May. So she sent me this big pack of um, 10 colours of tissue paper, 80, 80 sheets of tissue paper. Well, of course, you know, we're always interested in having tissue paper, especially for wrapping and things. But look at this gorgeous green and yellow, blue, orange, another green, another yellow, pink, purple, red, and then this hot pink. So, you know, this will be so useful. So, so useful. And then she sent me these packets of gems. So this one in um, red, they're all red. And then this one, which I love these ones. I've, I've, I've nearly finished using mine that's like this, um, these multicolored ones. And then she sent me these pearls and uh, sort of sparkly ones. So there's gray and pearl flat backs on both sides. And then there's the sparkly ones in a sort of a brownie color and clear. And, oops. And then these, this set of pearls, um, big, medium and small flatback pearls. So they are going to be so useful. And then she sent me a whole series of, of little um, boxes and bags that she's been making. It's amazing. So there's this lovely bag, you can see, um, which does up with this ribbon. And that comes out. And then got this lovely, you know, a good size thing inside, uh, space inside there. So it makes a lovely little handbag. And one of the sides of the arm has come off, but I can rectify that. Then she sent me this little box um, made with love. Uh, I think there must be a... Oh, wow, look at that. Can you see? It's a, a a box with three compartments. That is so lovely, Roz. Thank you. And then um, there's this little box tied up with a ribbon. Uh, it does feel a bit a bit um, heavy. So anyway, I'm going to open it off camera. Um, there's that. Then there's this gorgeous bag which has been made with. Um, this paper with trees on it and it's single sided and look at the, the handles she's plaited string with this um, leaf trim here on both sides and, and that opens up to make a very good sized carrier bag which, um, which is lovely and then she sent me another carrier bag which is full of more carrier bags so let's have a look it's like you know the big one and then the next size down this is this is really pretty with the um dotted paper and these will be very useful for for gifts ross um and we're ever looking for little bags so they'll be they will come in really handy so here's the next size down which, uh, this is a Christmas one, which says peace, joy, love and happiness and uh, joy and yes, it's beautiful. And then there's another one and this one has just got one handle and it's got a gift tag attached to it. Um, and also gorgeous paper with sprinkles on the inside. And then finally there's this teeny toty one which um, again just has the one handle and it has a, um, 
yeah, I think inside again with some gift tags and a lovely little bag. So, so there we are. So, the Gemini is still in the box, but it, it will get taken out hopefully in a short while. If I've got time now before tea, I'll do it. If not, then uh, later on. And um, thank you all for watching, and I'll be back who knows when with my next video. Bye for now.